Hi, and welcome to our next video dealing with algebra and determining um, someone's age. Here we're looking at um, a situation where you're given the two ages of the people. And you want to know here if Samantha is 98 years old and Betsy is 18, how many years will it be before Samantha is exactly five times older than Betsy? So the variable here is a little bit different from our last videos. Here, x is the number of years, right, that we need to pass before someone's exactly five times older than someone else. And I like this problem because it's very intuitive. Here we're saying that Samantha, right, if you take her age, 98, and add some amount of the years to it, so we have her age plus x, that will equal Betsy's age plus, you know, the same amount of years. But we're saying, when will it be when Samantha is exactly five times older than Betsy, which means that you take Betsy's age and multiply it by five. So five times Betsy's age is equal to Samantha's age, right? In, in how many years? So we set this up and now we solve for x. One of the first things I would do is distribute the five. Five times 18 and then five times x. And that will allow us to simplify the right-hand side. So what is 5 times 18? Well, 5 times, times 20 is 100, and 18 is 2 less than 20. So it's 10 less than 100, or 90. And 5 times x is 5x. So 90 plus 5x equals 98 plus x. Solving for x, I would do, let's do this at the same time here, subtract x from both sides, and subtract 90 from both sides. This is helpful because now what happens is that all of our numbers are on one side and, and the variables and coefficients are on the other. So 98 minus 90 is 8. x minus x is 0. 90 minus 90 is 0. And 5x minus x is just 4x. So now we have this problem to solve. 4x equals 8. Well, x has to be 2, right? But we can solve that, divided by 4 on both sides. 4x divided by 4 is just x. 8 divided by 4 is 2, so x equals 2. What does that mean? Well, that means in 2 years, Samantha will be 5 times older than Betsy. Let's test it out. Take Samantha's age, 98, and add 2, so it's 100. And that will be Betsy's age in 2 years. Take Samantha's, uh, Betsy's age, 18, and add 2 to get 20. And that will be Samantha's age in 2 years. And if you look at this, 100 is 5 times bigger than 20, right? Because 20 times 5 is 100. So in two years, Betsy will be 5 times older than Samantha. And in the next video, we'll look at a similar problem to this. So I hope this one's making a little bit of intuitive sense. Thanks.